Hey Dan, I like Sketchable. What else can you tell me about it? Well, now it's time to explore the color swatches and all the color options that Sketchable has in the app. Let's go. This is Digital Drawing and Sketchable with DTM. That's me. And I'm here to walk you through the color swatches in the Sketchable app. Let's go. Now let's go ahead and jump into Sketchable. I have my surface and I have my drawing ready to go. As you can see, I already started using some colors here and some of these pencils. And uh, along with these colors that I've been using uh, on the drawing, I've been using my color pots. So these are these little circles that you see here down below. What I like about these color pots is that you can choose a color that you're drawing with and then move on to another color pot, choose a different color and so on until you have the color pots filled with the colors that of your drawing. Now what happens when you run out of color pots? Well, the answer is you start doing some things that I just did right now, which is use my color picker. So let's say I want this brown, so I go ahead and use my color picker, there it is, and then move the pen right over the color I want. Boom, click on the screen, and there, my color pot has changed colors. That's one way of keeping track of your colors and uh, in a, an easy to access kind of way. Now, on the right hand side from the color picker we have, or eyedropper tool, sorry, we have a whole bunch of colors available to us. And it starts off with all the colors in the color wheel, but also it starts collecting the colors, the colors that you start to use. So here's some of the colors I've been using along with some of the colors I've been using down here. So uh, that's the last, uh, the uh, last, icon on the right hand side the color swatches and so if i want to keep track of this brown color a light brown color i can just add a plus and boom there it is uh, if i want to keep track of this green color i just do a plus and there it is and so now whenever i'm using any color and i say okay cool i want to go ahead and grab one of the other colors that i have i just go here tap it and boom i go here tap it and boom and that can stay up if you want while you're drawing or you can put it away and only bring it up when you need to. And so this is very helpful to have access to when you're using a lot of different colors. So now let me go ahead and make a, a new color, get a new color. There's our color wheel. So our color wheel has very, um, very different options for what we wanna do. So let me go ahead and get a yellow, boom, 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 there it is. And if you're uh, like me, I'm just freestyling, getting the color I want. We do also have a triangle. So now I can make sure that I'm getting that color opacity and saturation that I want along with the color wheel on the round the side. And if you're into RGB dials, there you go. If you're into HSB dials, there you go. Let me see, RMB, RGB and HSB. So there it is, boom, 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 from one end to the other some opacity and saturation. And then we have another color wheel. For those of you who are very exact about your colors, so if you have a hex color that you want to use. Boom, there it is, got it. Let's draw with it, yes, there it is. Bam, okay, cool, let's do, let's make it dramatic. Bam, show me. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> so as you can see, there's a whole lot of action happening on the bottom right hand corner from our color wheel icon. We can get to uh, having our color wheel pop off and that can stay up on the screen as long as you uh, want and you can put it away by clicking the icon again. Then we have our eyedropper tool. So then I can say, I want this color right there, bam. And now it fills in. And every color that you're using, as long it will fill in one of these pot colors as long as that pot color is selected. So whatever pot color I'm in, if I use my eyedropper tool, if I use um, the color wheel, that pot color is going to fill in, even if I use my color swatch over here. And there it is. Please check out all the different color options in Sketchable app to see what fits you best. 
We got the color wheel, color swatches, color pots, eyedropper tool. Hey, you let me know what's good for you, all right? This is Digital Drawing and Sketchable with DTM, and I hope that today's tips are helpful in expanding your digital drawing creativity. Please like and subscribe for more a Sketchable app insights. Talk to you later. Thank you.